which company would make a better long-term investment. Before we begin, I've made a separate analysis for each company, links in the description below. In this video, we're going to compare the business, the stock, and the price of each company, and then we'll put them together to get our final grade comparison. These factors are graded from 1 to 99, with 50 to 59 being considered average. I encourage you to pause this video anytime so you can better understand the numbers. First, let's look at the business. What we want to know is which company runs a better business. Based on the grades, here's our answer. Let's next look at the stock. What we want to know is which company has a better performing stock. Based on the grades, here's our answer. Let's then look at the price. What we want to know is which company's stock is more undervalued. Based on the grades, here's our answer. Before we get our final grades, consider becoming a GrowthShares patron and get access to my spreadsheet with every grade from every company I've analyzed. It's updated all the time. Head to patreon.com forward slash GrowthShares or click in the link in the description. Let's put our three factors together to get the final grades for both companies. Based on these grades, we know which company is a better long-term investment. This analysis uses public financial data, research, and a proprietary algorithm to come up with the grades. But what are your thoughts? Do you agree? Want to talk business? Email me and follow the instructions on the screen. Invest wisely, and as always, take care of your money.